and those who are new to the channel, this is my boy Lucky. He's my best friend, and I just wanted to introduce y'all. Say hi, Lucky. Say hi to YouTube. <laughs> okay, so anyways, back to this thing. So yeah, on my last video, I told y'all how I bought this most unreliable Cadillac. Paid 650 bucks for this thing, believe it or not. But it did not look like this. I cleaned it up already, kind of. I'm not done, but I just want to show y'all the plan for this one. I've always liked these big bodies growing up, so I was like, man, I've been seeing it sit there for like a couple years now, and I asked the guy, I was like, hey, would you want to sell it? And he's like, sure, why not? So I ended up buying it. But if y'all want to check it out, this is the inside. It's a little dusty. Want to check it out, Lucky? Go, get in. Go, Lucky. Oh yeah. Lucky approved. Is it comfy? Yeah? So yeah, it does. I bought it knowing the guy told me that the, ga the head gasket was blown on it, but for anybody that knows a little bit about North Stars, it's usually not the head gasket that's blown, it's the, the head bolts they strip from the block since this is an aluminum block and the threads they use from the factory are really small threads or whatever so i'm already looking into the north star performance the head bolt kit so i'm thinking i'm gonna do that it's like 700 dollars for the kit so i'm like man 650 and then 700 for that kit so i'll be in it maybe 14 1500 if that and i'm gonna try and fix it myself even though i'm not like the best mechanic but i can do oil changes spark plugs so this is gonna be literally the biggest project that I will ever tackle. But with y'all's help, man, I mean, I could be able to afford to get this thing fixed. So I'm just saying, instead of following all these thotomuses on YouTube and all these chicks showing ass and tits for money, help a brother out, dude. I'm just trying to get some cars fixed. <laughs> that would be so awesome. Get some more subscribers and then I can buy more. I'll be like the OG Hoopty Garage, like before he got rich and started buying non Hoopties. He was actually, now he buys not Hoopties, he buys like badass, nice cars, which I mean, I, I ain't got nothing against him. That's, I mean, I'm, I'm really happy for Hoopty. That's awesome, but that's what really made me love his channel was whenever he was buying shit boxes like this and take him car wizard and get him fixed and then boom, have fun with them. So that's the plan. If I can get more channels, that's what I want to do, guys. That's my plan. So yeah, y'all want to hear it? I'll try it. <laughs> See if it turns on. This is the key. Catalog. Okay. And for 2002, I was surprised. Digital dash. All right, let's see what it does. Oh. Oh, it didn't do nothing. The battery's dead. Well, yeah, that's just normal Cadillac things. So yeah, but anyways, when the battery was good, it was turning over just fine, but it's like it's not getting fuel. So I'm pretty sure the fuel pumps out on it too. It was like $100, $120 part, so that ain't cheap. I mean, that is that is cheap, but the, the head bolt kit is gonna be the most expensive part. And honestly, like for the price of that head bolt kit, honestly, I think maybe, just buying a spare motor. What do you guys think? Because I've seen these North Stars on Marketplace already, 500 bucks with the engine transmission combo. There's a couple things I can do, but I want to definitely keep the cost down because I mean, I only paid 650 for it. I'm not trying to put like two grand into it. Worst comes to worst, I'll just keep it clean, put some wheels on it, put a system, and then I could just pull it to car shows with my truck just say that it's like yeah it's just a show car like so does it run like nah it doesn't run but it looks cool and i put a system in it <laughs> i thought that would have been funny too but yeah this is the whip i'll give you all a walk around the guy i bought it from it was his mom's car so hence the somewhat decent 
decent condition it's in. It's not bad. It's got a little... I know y'all saw this dent probably in that last video. It's got this little chingalera right here. But other than that... It's got a little bit... Just a little bit of rust. Nothing too crazy. Let's show y'all my favorite part of this car. It's gotta be... The quad exhaust. Yas. So yeah. I could do a walk around of the truck if y'all want next. If anybody wants to check out the truck, let me know. See y'all later. Have a good day.